Okay, Mickey ears on, and now we can start with the video. Hey guys, welcome to Dis Travel Duo. So yes, I figured I would put my ears because what other place is a respectable place for a grown woman like me to wear ears besides Disney World? Well, when doing a Disney World or a Disney related video, so here we are. So here is the box that I got. I have a suspicion of what it is, but I'm not quite sure, but I wanted to open it together with you guys. So here we go. Uh, sorry, not the best lighting, not the best angle of the camera, but I'm working with what I have. Hopefully soon I will have a better, a better setup. So let me try to take this off. You didn't okay, so after a, a lifetime of looking for scissors, we got some. And let's see, hopefully it is. Watch it be like, I don't know, not Disney related. It is, it is, it is, it is. I am so happy and excited. Look what I got. It is my first, my very, very first Magic Candle Company subscription box. Um, as I open this, I will start telling you a little bit about it. I think you can, I'm not sure if you can buy it just one time or they do like a thing where you subscribe for like a month or three months or six months or for the whole year. Um, and I think like the more months you get, you get a little discount. And if you hear noises in the background, that's our dog playing. <laughs> what are you doing, boy? Why right now, Russell? Say hi. Look. Say hi. Hello. Okay. Back to the main event. Oh, no. <laughs> now he comes. No, I didn't mean come. You can stay over there, boy. Go. You get a trial of this. You can subscribe for either like a month. You can subscribe for like um, the year. I did it for like three months and you do have to pay ahead of time. And they give it out every fourth of the month, I think. Uh, that's when they deliver but let's see I have no idea what's in here I have no idea what's the scent of the month for the subscription box so let's just open this up and see what we get so in this subscription box I got oh Walter's office scent I guess that's the scent um, anyways it comes with this this is like a car freshener or you can hang it anywhere but I like the little packaging though how pretty the little shreds are and everything and what is this oh my gosh it includes a pin are you kidding me look at this that is actually really cool that is very cute it's like a little desk and a chair I don't know if you can tell, my camera is not very good anymore, but, oh wow, I love it, that's so cute. And then, oh, that is so lovely. I got um, some wax melts, and these last a very good time. I currently have the Pop Sentry that I ordered last time, just um, the Pop Sentry themselves, not 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 a subscription box, but an individual, an individual order, and these last a good chunk of time. Wow, that's interesting. Okay, and I am going to smell it and tell you my opinion. Oh wow! Whoa, this is kind of open. Um, this is Walter's office, and it is the candle, I believe. Let's see. Yep, it is, let's see, oh here, it describes the scent right here. It says, it's Walter's office features a delightful, rich, warm, and spicy aroma of cured pipe tobacco with touches of honey, rose, and violet. That is interesting. I'm not sure how I want to smell like tobacco, but we'll see right now. And then last but not least is this, and this is a room deodorizer, a room spray. So that's nice. And so this is uh, four ounces of the spray. There you go. Oh, I like the wick. Let me smell it. Now that I have it right here, let me smell it. I like it. 
it's not it does not smell like I thought it was gonna smell when I heard tobacco I thought oh my gosh this is gonna smell like cigar or something and it doesn't it has like a very it I can smell the undertone but it's like that nice old tobacco and but I do get hints of like I don't know if it's the honey it's really nice. It's like a very, it's like a very nice aftershave cologne kind of, but not too strong. I like it. It gives me like autumn vibes or winter vibes right now, and I've been wanting something like this. Oh, I'm I'm gonna light this up tomorrow. The lovely wax melts, which I love wax melts. And uh, the car, I think like this could be like a car freshener cute the last but not least this beautiful pin i cannot believe it that is amazing that is beautiful and i will use it tomorrow and then i'll let you guys know how i like it so welcome back everyone i have tried out all these scents that i got in my magic candle company subscription box and i am here i am here to share with you what I think about this very first subscription box for Magic Candle Company that I ordered. So, first, so the candle itself is beautiful. It has this beautiful uh, wick right here that makes a beautiful crackling noise when you uh, light it up. Every single time I've lit it up, it makes a beautiful such a scent because that's obviously very important i'm not gonna lie when i first opened the box and saw the description of the scents which i will remind you it says it has a delightful rich warm and spicy aroma of cured pipe tobacco with touches of honey rose and violet so when i read that it had touches of uh, cured tobacco i was like that is such a weird scent you know like i don't know if i'm gonna like this scent uh, it makes sense that it's called Walter's Office because if you guys don't know, which most of us probably do, he was a smoker. So we can imagine him sitting in his office smoking a little tobacco. Um, not that I advocate that or <laughs> whatever, but you know. So I was quite intrigued and I was like, hmm, I don't know. And then I opened it and I was like, okay, it doesn't smell like the tobacco that I imagined in my head, but I don't know how I will feel like actually turning this on. Let me say, first I was impressed by the wick, the crackling noise. I love ASMR and this this is it. Uh, the other thing is I was pleasantly shocked and surprised by how much I liked this scent. It doesn't make sense, it's tobacco. Um, and the other scents, that it, the, the, the hints, the notes of the smells here, it just kind of confused me, but I like it. It gives me very nice, warm cozy fall winter vibes it, it gives it like a little cabin feel i don't know i like it and i can actually detect the different notes like at different times like i'll i'll light my candle i'll leave it on for like an hour or two and then i'll turn it off and when i'm when it's actually on i have like this scent like a certain scents are more pronounced and then when it's off and the scent lingers it really does linger all day I love it then I pick up like oh it's it's more sweeter not as tobacco -y. or then sometimes I'm like oh wait now I'm picking a hint of tobacco but it's not like a tobacco like your common cigarette it's different it's nice I like it personally I was I was really 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 surprised with these scents then the sweetness of the honey comes through and it, this, then you get a hint of rose. It's really, really well done. I'm really happy with this candle and I have used it for, I would say, five hours if not more. And you can see where the um, the candle is at. Okay, so it is uh, very lasting quite a long time. And then you do get tunneling, but they do give a suggestion if your candle does start to tunnel, you make a little tin foil hat for it, and then it just, it's perfect. So that's the candle. And let me show you, actually, because back here, I started to put, okay, so here's the thing with me. I am very, like, 
a penny pincher, you could say. And so I don't like spending stuff. I like to use it sparingly. But I'm like, okay, this is a subscription box. So I'm going to be getting one of these for the next following two months again. So I need to use these up. They cannot stay locked up in my closet. I need to use them. So how did I figure I would use them? I would incorporate them in my room, in my decor. So I have this little tower right here where I have some different items. And I don't know if you can see, but down here I have the actual uh, set. Uh, I'm not sure if it's coming through, but anyways, I have the, um, the room spray, which I will talk about it in a bit. And then I have... And then I have the melts, the wax melts, and then the um, the air, the car freshener. I'm gonna be honest, I have not used the wax melts, but I can tell you that they smell just as beautiful in the packaging as the other stuff. Um, and I haven't used it because in my previous uh, wax melt, I currently have the Pop Century scent in there from the same company um, that I bought like. A few years back and I still have some so I can only imagine how long these are gonna last and I am here for it because I love it so I haven't used these and then the car freshener I honestly don't think I'm gonna use it anytime soon not because I don't want to but because we are only a one car family and my daughter is the one that's currently using it since I work from home she needs it more to travel to school and etc so She's using it. She uh, personally says she doesn't like it, not because it doesn't smell nice, but because she's more of a fruity person. And yeah, I completely understand her. But she says it's also a pleasant smell. It's just not her smell. So she's not going to put it in the car. I might put this like maybe in, in my closet to, you know, prevent smells. Or maybe I'll just save it and eventually if I do end up getting a car myself, uh, then I'll stick it in there. But, um... We'll see about that. But anyways, let me talk about the room deodorizing spray. Extremely, extremely surprised by this again. I used it yesterday for the first time. I was doing like a deep, thorough cleaning in my room. And I used this spray. And let me just tell you that I'm in love. I don't know if I like this more than the... I'm not sure if I like this room spray more than the candle. Not because they smell different. They, it's amazing how throughout the products that they provide, the scent actually remains the same. Is when I was cleaning my room, I went ahead and sprayed this a couple times. And I'm going to go ahead and spray it. That I spread in the, like, a little bit afternoon, like around 12.30 or 1.00. And it lasted the entire evening. I could still smell it, actually, but I burnt something when I was cooking right now, so the other smells creeped up here. But I sprayed that just now, and it just fills the whole room with the beautiful scent. And it lasts such a long time. And just like with the candle, the scents, you get like different notes. I am so happy, and like I said, I'm a penny pincher, but I am so glad I bought the three month. Now, I don't want to get ahead of myself, because I don't know, you know, if I'm going to get a scent that I like next month, or if this is like a one-off only, and the scents are beautiful and perfect in this box. So I want to wait until give my final verdict, but if things continue just, if things continue just as good as it went with this box... I'm afraid I'm going to have to keep getting more boxes because I'm really enjoying it. And what better way to get Disney into our homes if we cannot get to Disney, we can bring the scents. And it's just, I'm so excited. And this video is way too long, so I'm just going to have to cut myself. And you can hear my dog barking right now. But anyways, I'm going to have to cut myself off of this video because I could go on and on. I am so happy. Uh, 10 out of 10, honestly, I don't have a negative thing to say. Um, I honestly don't. Uh, so if you guys have any questions or if there's anything that I didn't answer or cover, please leave it down below. Or if you have been subscribed to this beautiful Magic Candle Company subscription box, let me know which ones have been your favorite scents and why. What does it remind you of? 
and then um, we can have a little conversation going because I always like to get other people's perspective and other people's opinions, especially when it comes to sets related to Disney because that is amazing. Bringing Disney home seriously, it's amazing. I cannot wait. Um, so I will, I have some videos actually posted on my Instagram and on my TikTok. Uh, where I share a little bit of the candle, turning it on. You can hear the crackling noise and know what I'm talking about. It is amazing. Okay, I said it. I'm leaving. Thanks so much for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't done so and give us a like. Comment, like I said, your favorite candles that you've gotten from Magic Candle Company. Which ones do you recommend? And then, um, I guess that's it. So, thanks so much for watching. Like I said, see you real soon.